when I was in China, I didn't have chance to take dance because, you know, they they have a lot of requirements for dancers. Like you have to be like certain weight to learn dance. And now, like in Korea, I feel like I can start a new thing that I've never done before. And I feel like dancing is really amazing way to express one's emotion and feelings. We have like jazz, ballet, tap, hip hop, a lot of things like that. And what you do have to audition for is advanced um, jazz, which is also the varsity team. I tried one year, didn't make it, but I decided, you know what, I'm gonna stick with it. I just joined Intermediate Jazz, and then the next year I got an Advanced Jazz. I have Jossie and Andrea as teachers for dance, and they're they're tough when it comes to being like, you need to do this, you need to do that, but they're good dance teachers because you learn a lot from them. Walk it in! We ain't rolled up! It's a really great inspiration to have them there because they prepare us the way professionals prepare. You know, they really put emphasis on hard work and in taking things seriously. You got to go. They don't need me to to tell them is what I try to instill in them. That is what I I learned at Point Park College was the best thing. They taught me how to teach myself, and that's what I try to do with them. That I don't I don't tell them anymore to be on time. We don't even talk about it. It's just just the role. You come in, you come ready, you focus, you work, and uh, really it's just respecting everybody else for their time and, and we end up having a good time then together. She says that dancers just know how to act in an interview, they just know how to like handle themselves, they're very responsible and they're also very quick, literally quick on their feet. We did an acapella tap dance. I think even Andrea was kind of sketchy on whether we'd be able to pull it off because acapella is very hard in tap. Last one. Good. So we're going to get there. I know it's harder to like break up counts like that rather than just having a whole sequence, which is why I decided to do acapella because it is a challenge. We worked really hard in class. And like if one person messed up, we all have to start over. So we had to start learning to count on one another for counts and beats and stuff like that. So when we went to the competition in Altoona called Motion, we were kind of nervous whether it would do good or bad, and it wound up doing really good. We got first place in senior group. The building's great, obviously, for uh, classwork, uh, that we, we had the opportunity to have performance this year. The theater seating seats 320, and the floor is a sprung Marley floor, which is the best. We have the same floor as New York City Ballet. It's a great floor to uh, take classes in because it helps prevent injury. We can bring in professional companies and then get master classes through it, so we're, we're very fortunate. I know anybody that walks in and sees the space from even professional companies or are amazed at it, they, they love it. Last year we got the, the opportunity to go to New York and we performed right in Times Square. We went there and we knew what we were doing because we were well prepared because the teachers really, you know, they get you ready for whatever you're performing. You were right on the stage in Times Square, people could walk by and watch you dancing. Like everyone's watching you, it's really exciting. So I don't know, as a dancer that's really something I'll, I'll never forget, it was great fun.